Hey guys, it's Emsonese, and <laughs> this is some random video because uh, I don't really know what to upload. But here is my sword collection or training sword collection. Uh, these are not all my swords, these are just the swords I like. Not all of these are mine, so it's my family or my mine and my brother's sword collection. So uh, here is my katana, my practice katana. It is a little bent, but I can bend it back. Um, if you didn't know, it comes with a a guard right here, but it's like Suzuki's sword in Naruto because it has no guard. I'll just grab the guard real quick. It's over here. It's just pretty easy to get on. Here's the guard. So just put the guard on like this. Uh, put it on wrong. Yeah, I think I put it on wrong. Oh, no. I'll just put it on later. Yes, yeah, correctly, I think. Okay, if I can't take this, I'll just... I don't know. Uh, sorry for the background noise. I don't feel like, like putting the guard on right now. But, yeah. So... Yeah, I'll just put that to the side. Next is my brother's samurai. It has a grip and a guard. It's wooden, but the, the what is it? The grip is sort of like messed up because it comes off all the time. The grip is sort of messed up in the, and it's like wood, so it's probably not, uh, it's pretty sturdy wood. The guard is like too flimsy. The guard wasn't really made well. The grip is not made well either, but it still works. So it's pretty good. Uh, this one is not bent. It's made out of like pure wood. So I like this one. This one is very nice. Put that to the side. Uh, it's the last sword. Uh, these are like all, this is a Japanese officer sword training sword and it has a bunch of like patterns on it i don't think you guys can see it but there's a bunch of patterns on it it's pretty cool um yeah we got it at a renaissance fair and there's some patterns here but it's for like so it's like really bendable and yeah it's really bendable if you didn't know it's supposed to be bendable if i sh shake it like that it's gonna bend so yeah that's not all my swords but i don't know i just felt like no. So here is my actually like it's a mini one. This one right here. It's just tiny and small. Good to practice with, but it's too like I can barely uh fit both of my hands on it. So this these are my swords. Like my swords over here. Sorry, that's a mess. Um, I'm packing a bunch of stuff. But, yeah, those are my swords and this cool rack I got. Uh, this thing. It's thingy. So, thingy is cool. Just put your swords on it. Just put your swords on it. Like that. Do it like this so you don't ruin the blade like that. And it's supposed to go like this. You don't ruin the blade. You don't put it on like that, you pull it on like that so it doesn't ruin the blade that much. Uh, this is like, like, Japanese officer sword isn't really like meant for it. But you can put it on there, but it's not meant for it. This sword, my sword, uh, just put it on like that. It's really cool sword rack. It's sort of flimsy, but it's just meant to stay put. There's a lot of sword racks like this. Um, this one's pretty cool, but it's like a little flimsy. There, I'm sure there's better swords and like katanas. Um, obviously, we just got the practice swords just because I think it's like way easier. So we like, anyways, my mom and dad don't think we're responsible enough for like actual katanas. So we just got the practice swords. Pretty cool. So yeah, it's been M Sneeze and that was um
my sword collection here is like pretty much all my Asian swords because they all this is a katana all four of the all three of these are katanas and this one is a Japanese officer sword in which the Japanese infantry or like the pilots had the katanas so yeah that's some history for you guys but it's been Epstein. I'll see you guys later. Peace.